Hi, Chris. Yeah, you're right. It's not great pickleball weather unless you really like it chilly when you play. It's more like ice skating weather, which is what we're looking at right now. People enjoying the rink. We do have the bright sunshine, and as long as you are bundled up, not a bad day. Right now, it's mostly sunny. It's 43 degrees, which on its face, obviously very chilly. Then you factor in the gusty winds. We are seeing wind gusts right now to 30 miles an hour. So the temperatures are already very chilly. I mean, really kind of cold. Uh, 34 degrees for Monticello, 43 for Poughkeepsie and White Plains, 45 for Brick. The Hamptons is at 47, but the winds are gusting pretty significantly. 20 to 30 mile an hour wind gusts, 32 in Brick, so it is cold, it is windy, so it feels much colder than what the temperature says, right? Feels like 36 degrees right now in Central Park. Feels like 37 for White Plains and Brick, as well as Babylon and Greenwich. It feels like 27 degrees in Monticello. And so what happens is we watch this cold air Air, this cold air mass move in today, but it stays with us through the weekend and into the early part of next week. So that means things will just plain cold. Um, some of the coldest air of the season, it'll make our high temperatures. Basically, it'll put us 5 to 15 degrees below what is considered normal or what we would typically see during this time of year. And then when you factor in the wind chill, it will feel like it's in the 30s, 20s, and sometimes teens as we head into those overnight hours. So we're in for a pretty cold stretch, so much so that that, uh, yeah, some of the surviving uh, flakes uh, are making it into the area. We see a little bit of flurry activity from some of what we're seeing in upstate New York. So that's a possibility. As we turn on your future cast, you'll see a couple of things. One is a few of those uh, flakes could possibly survive and move through. So seeing a flurry as we head into the day tomorrow is not completely unheard of. Saw a couple of flurries this morning, but that's pretty much it. Things are still a little too dry for us to get any real precipitation over the next few days. So dry but cold and windy, that's how we'll be as we head into the weekend. Here's a little bit of a, of a snow band that moves through. This is Friday, 8 p.m. So we do have that slide chance. Otherwise, it is going to be bright, it's going to be cold, and it's going to be windy, and that's how it'll stay through the early part of next week. 40 for your Saturday, 39 degrees for your Sunday, although it will feel like the 20s. The good news is, as we head to next week, Wednesday, you can see the high goes up to 50 degrees as people travel. Chris? Okay, Lily, thank you. New